Hey, everyone, how's it going? Blue Riser here. So I decided before I take on America, it's probably best for me to do some interludes. And what most important interlude is there? Nero's. I didn't do it yet. I I saw it and I'm like, let me just put it on the back burner, back burner, back burner, back burner. And it kept being put on the back burner. So now I'm doing it today because I need that third skill. If you don't know what the third skill is, well, I guess you'll see that at the end. Sorry about that. I have some personal business I need your help with. The United Empire is gone and Rome is in the inferior peace. However, the one who led Rome as his first citizen, Nero Claudius, is no longer there. What does that mean? What are you talking about? You're right here in front of me. Rather, the human Nero is no longer there because I contracted with you. The human Nero has already left Rome, just like in history. Now I sit as its emperor. The heir's ability to bring back the past, no, to repair itself. As long as a servant Nero is here, Emperor Nero will must be dead. Oh yeah, that makes a lot of sense. In normal space and time, both human before death and the servant after death can exist simultaneously. Wait, did I read that right? Both human before death and the servant after death can exist simultaneously? What does that mean? In normal space and time, does she mean like in the past he can, like Nero is a person and then later in the future Nero can be a servant, but they can't be at the simultaneous, I don't know. But in the singularity, what's accurate and what's stronger ends up taking precedent. Okay, I kinda get what you mean. Once the Holy Spirit Nero contracted with you, the Nero at Septum became this Nero, unfortunately. Well, it's a confusing problem, so I ended up using a negative expression. Emperor Nero, no Nero, you are definitely here in Rome. I'm happy about such fortune, Emperor. You really are a nice girl, Mash. You feel regret for your mistakes and feel happy when good things happen, like most people probably would. <laughs> I don't know what you're getting at, Nero. I'll forgive what you said with that smile of yours. You can accompany me in the bath later as an apology. Oh, not good. I always get carried away when you're around. There's only one reason why we've come to Septum. I want you to help me, Master. Remember when I brought out that boat last time? I heard a little something during the voyage. Supposedly there's a ghost that appears in the cursed desert on the outskirts of Rome. I think I might know who that ghost is. Right now, I'm carrying out my royal duties as a servant, but I'm not sure when I'll finish them and disappear. That's why before that happens, I want to ease Rome's pain with my own two hands. I'd love to help you. It's my <laughs> only option. <laughs> the sun's gone down, master. It's a familiar scene, but I also feel lonely here. It's like no one's here, a stage everyone's forgotten about. It should be around here, the shape of the rocks, the sound of the wind, the faded color of the setting sun. I remember it all, even now the fate of an emperor who died here in these wastelands. Nero, is this... Mm, this is where I died. Nero Claudia slit her own throat here. Nero loved the people and she continually showered her burning passion. However, it wasn't the warm love people knew of. Nero only knew how to love one way, to demand, give, and burn away violently. It was like forcing people to do things you may say. Nero didn't realize, even until her end, that her actions were like a poison to the people. Nero made a mistake that weakened her own position and was chased away from her throne by the Senate. The army turned against her, but even then she believed that the people she loved so passionately would defend her. I don't think I need to tell you what happened. The people didn't defend the foolish tyrant. Although Nero escaped from her pursuers, she chose to end her life out of grief. I can't say what Nero was grieving over, just that her life ended here. But Nero didn't die that easily, or more like she couldn't die. Rather, she couldn't breathe. Her heart ached, her eyes burned. It was like being driven into madness by a never ending fever. Three days passed and Nero still wasn't discovered by her pursuers. She woke at the sunset each day, for she thought she heard people calling out her name. It was the sound of people that she loved. She knew they didn't blame the Emperor Nero, that they were praising her. Even so, Nero awoke just to verify what she heard. At the first sunset, she sniffed her nose to the illusion. At the second sunset, she bit her lips to the inaudible calls. At the third sunset, that's right, Emperor Nero said her last words. A soldier found her body, exposed in the wilderness, out of pity, covered her with a cloth. At that moment, Emperor Nero opened her eyes and said, Too late, but how noble of you. Yeah, well, shit, dude. My fate <laughs> ended there. I don't know what Nero was thinking at the very end. How does she not, like, wait, how does she not know what she was thinking? Did I miss something? Servants are fragments of people from the throne of heroes. Cause doesn't Arturia know what she wants? Doesn't she remember her life pretty vividly? I wanna have to go back, I don't remember. She's not talking like this just for the sake of being artsy fartsy, right? But Nero was okay with that, even if it wasn't the people she loved so much. The tyrant was happy that her life ended with the warmth of a human. That's the deus ex machina that I dream of even now. Because no matter what happened, it was a very miracle which made 
the story a happy ending. If that soldier hadn't come along, I would still have been waiting in the wilderness for the impossible. And that is why. Why I must kill you. A tyrant's wandering dream, a reflection of a flower that forgot how to wither. The ghost of mine that cannot accept the end. Show yourself and take up your sword. There it is. The ever so dreaded ghost of Nero. A collection of powerful magical energy. What is this? It's a ghost, Mash, obviously. She said a ghost. It's not the shadow of a servant, nor is it a ghost. It's like a demon god. Well, okay. Fifth Emperor Nero Claudius implores you, my master. Limit your strength. I might be a bit late, but I shall right my wrongs with my own sword. You idiot, how can an actor refuse to let the curtain go down? We thrive, then perish. We cannot avoid death, and the ending cannot be changed. That is why we sing. That is why we scream. I neither give up on nor lament what I love. No matter how many times that final curtain comes down. I can hear it, the call from the capital, the six. Farewell, the girl who never went back to being me. Worthless mumbles to myself, don't worry about it. In any event. Smile, yep. That was wonderful. I expect nothing less from you. I knew you were dependable. Thanks to you, that which disturbed Rome. I feel lonely now. I think I can get depressed here. No, that's not it. The people were just being nice and pretending they didn't see me. That's the Roman citizens and Nero for you. They're the best. I was victorious because of all of you. I'll show you my thanks on the battlefield. Anyway, let's get back to Chaldea, Master. Let's bring thunderous applause to this earth. Master! Alright, with that, that's done. Okay, so this is what her skill is. Apply guts to yourself three times for five turns. Well, in, the, in the duration of five turns, I should say. Pretty cool, I would have to say. Um, Nero is, has great staying power on the field. And, you know, that's what the whole story was about, too. Her falling and then getting back up. Or per, her persistence not to die. Overall, great, I maxed it out. Well, not maxed. But I got another skill, I got her final skill, now I'm gonna work on leveling that up for the upcoming America Singularity. I want to do a bit more interludes because I don't want to jump into America just yet. I'm not really ready. I'll definitely get around to it maybe like in the next coming days or so. But definitely I don't want to touch it right now. With that being said, just expect some more interludes to come out. It, it's the best way for me to just have some downtime on these fake videos. I just did a summoning video for Florence Nightingale if you haven't checked it out. Uh, click on the little eye icon at the top if I remember to put it there. It should be there or just check out the end of the video and also we'll have a new outro video. I'm not sure if anyone really cares, um, but I like the outro videos. I think each of them kind of represent a different part of not only the story, but also like where I am in this game, like how I feel about it. Every single outro we've done so far has had been a different song and different uh, visuals at the end. So, you know, I like it, but I think it's something that most people probably won't care about, especially since my videos are pretty long. Most people probably never seen them too. But there's a perfect chance if you've made it this far to check it out. Uh, the summary video should be at the end card there. I think I'm just going to put it there instead of the eye. Other than that, I'll definitely see you guys next time. 
Tell me what you liked about the interlude or just overall thoughts and opinions. Um, we're still going to, I'm going to keep up with this new editing style of the CG screens or I should say artwork. If you just ask what's this art here, I can find it for you. Maybe I'll put together some sort of like resource center or a resource page on my website to help people find the art. Also with the new art scenes now, we're also going to have uh, new background music because some of it kind of gets repetitive. I want to see what kind of music America has if any new music is introduced, if anything. Don't worry, it's not going to stray away from really fate stuff. I'm going to download the original soundtrack anyway. I just think if I have it playing instead of it playing off my phone and it play through, um, through like me editing it in, it will sound better, especially with the cuts and stuff like that. But yeah, I've already ended this video once. Let me end it again. See you guys next time. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, especially if you're new here. Peace out.